My name is Aaron Burnham Schmidt. I grew up in San Diego, mostly around East County. I graduated from El Cap High School. Um, I currently attend the University of California, Berkeley, and I'm studying applied math with a concentration in computer science, and I'm going to pick up a, a minor in bioengineering. So I would describe my time at Graceland College as very exploratory and self-developmental oriented. And really what I mean by that is that maybe I didn't explicitly come in with the intent to develop myself further, but I feel that the situations that Grossmont put me into so an example of that is like the diversity that Grossmont enjoys as a result of its surrounding community. I had not interacted with nearly as many cultures as I had prior to coming to Grossmont. And that was something that really made me think about the way I am as a person and how my culture has affected me. So I think my crowning achievement at Grossmont College was in my last semester. Um, I took 19 units, got all A's. So that was a really big accomplishment for me. Um, I hadn't gotten all A's. Um, except for my first semester when I got here. And then after that, being the director of publicity for ASGC, I created a marketing plan for it. Um, I'd never created a marketing plan before, but it was a very good experience. They're currently in the process of implementing that right now. Um, I've had some correspondence, which feels really good. Um, I organized a research symposium as the vice president of leadership for Phi Theta Kappa. I'd never organized an event before. That event was solely on me. Normally, when I'd helped with an event before, it had really been like a collaboration with other people. And so it really felt nice to have this thing come together and it all be my doing. I even paid for the food, which felt really good. And then continuing to affect my community and impact it positively as an outreach ambassador. Um, there are some shocks that really um, took me as a surprise when I went to UC Berkeley. Um, I think UC Berkeley is very renowned and it's a very world-class institution. So there are a lot of people that are very well known from there. We wouldn't have particle accelerators without UC Berkeley. And I think naturally that just, that draws a different type of people than what I'm used to here. I feel like my core group of friends was very diverse at Grossman College. Whereas now my core group of friends comprises of people that like their dads are the owners of like $10 billion companies. And things like that really came as like a culture shock to me personally. Um, and there's really nothing Gross on College could have done to prevent that. Um, and realistically, it doesn't even really affect me in the end. Um, but there, there are things like that that did, that, that did shock me upon my entry into UC Berkeley. And especially as a low income student myself, um, that's, that's something that was like a, it made me feel a bit alienated for a bit, I guess you could say. But in terms of academic rigor, I feel that my accomplishments and my grades at Grossmont College were indicative of how I'm going to continue to perform at UC Berkeley. I don't actually feel like I'm unequipped to take my classes there. Honestly, I don't feel like I use that many resources while I was here. I was always just like the type of person to like do everything on my own. Um, but what I did use were like specific people here. So um, specifically like Sydney Brown, she was my English professor um, for English 124. She was a fantastic person, helped me articulate my worldview and really find my footing um, as an adult and really helped me find like my own sense of responsibility. Um, Eddie Beto Vasquez, outreach coordinator, my previous boss, um, really, really helped me kickstart my drive for civic engagement and community engagement, uh, specifically the community, community engagement. As an outreach ambassador, like, I never thought that I would really have such a drive to um, impact as many people as I do now, and that's, that's very much so thanks to him. Um, Barbara Gallego, she was our advisor for ASGC. Honestly, just a fantastic person, uh, mentored me pretty much throughout my entire journey at Grossmont College, um, was always interacting with her, um, and yeah, really appreciate, really, really appreciate the mentorship that she offered me. And honestly, just throwing the rest of the outreach team. Some of my closest friends are on that team. And yeah, I just haven't really met that many more genuine people than that. I think my primary advice is just to try it. Like this place, you've heard all the opportunities that I've gotten at this point. Um, and I think that those are really open to almost everyone, anyone can do what I did. I, I, I truly think that. And, and really, I think that's all it is. And it's pretty low committal, um, it's low cost. Um, the classes that you're getting here, they, they can be very thought provoking. They, they can help you as a person. Um, I've had professors that have changed my life. Um, and the people that I've met here, even more so they've changed my life. And I think that every person deserves to experience that. 
If you decide it's not for you, that's fine, but you should try.